right, I just got this package from Amazon. Let me show you what it is. It's a new DJI pocket. And this camera is gonna be awesome because this is the gimbal that I use. It's pretty good to record. It's awesome. But it doesn't have the features that this other gimbal from DJI has. And I wanna try it and I wanna show you guys what it looks like and how small it is compared to this one here. And this is the latest model that came out in October. Look how small it is. There it is. Compared to my other gimbal, this is like six times heavier than this. And this is a remote microphone. It's real small and it has this little rubber foot and it works as a microphone. You can hide it inside your clothes and get a small microphone that you can put here or anywhere and this will be a secondary microphone even though the new pocket comes with four microphone one in each corner and every time you turn the camera the microphone is supposed to be changing to where the camera is pointed so you can get a good accurate sound which is awesome to have that and also came with this extension that goes down here what this extension does is it's a speaker um, it also has a charger here and also has a microphone jack right here that you can attach any microphone to it so this came with a combo which is a lot cheaper to buy the combo than not buying it uh, all together I already activated it took me a little while you do have to get your phone and attach it to the unit and agree on terms uh, if you don't do that this is not going to work you have to agree on terms and you have to download a firmware update in order for this to work so you don't just pick this out of the box and start shooting it works perfect uh it's nighttime right now and it's awesome at nighttime the low light image it is nothing compared to the gopro hero or the older gopro hero what i like about it is you tap this button here three times and the camera turns to you so if I'm filming that way and all of a sudden I want to film towards me instead of turning the camera I can just press this button here three times and the camera will flip the other side real quick it's awesome I love that and also it has face track awesome little camera right now it's nighttime but I'm gonna show you right now daytime what it looks like outside
So as you saw, that I was recording during the day, it's an awesome camera. Really, really like it. It's more cinematic. It's a very good gimbal. I have used it for a long time and it works awesome. The battery life is about six to eight hours. So this gimbal is the one that I always use and it's been awesome. Now, GoPro Hero 5, 6, 7 and on, the microphone is terrible because the sound is hitting in these little speakers because it's waterproof, right? So this is a great action camera. Awesome. But if you want sound quality out of this, this is pure garbage, right? So this is the best right here. GoPro Hero 4 is one of the best cameras and probably three that GoPro did. It's not a camera that you can just throw in the water and that's it. But they have a case for it. The reason this is the best camera is the mic. Right here, it has a mic that you can put and the quality of the sound you get out of this is awesome. Just plug it in here and record. And you get awesome sound. It's incredible. That's why I like the GoPro Hero 4. Right now, they don't make it anymore, and I destroyed one of them the other day uh, with my flare gun. Accidentally, I shot my GoPro with the flare gun, right? So I destroyed one. So that's why I have to get another camera. So the GoPro Hero 4, if you can buy it right now, is one of the best cameras you can buy. The new GoPro Heroes, I had so many problems with them. They were freezing, uh, you had to take the battery out. They were terrible. Terrible GoPro cameras, right? This one's the Hero 4, the best cameras. Never been frozen. They work awesome. The newer cameras, like I said, they're just terrible. Like, like I just tossed that one right here. This one right here. Nothing happened to it. Didn't crack. Very tough, right? They're very, very tough, but they're terrible cameras for the sound. So definitely I do not recommend the GoPro Hero 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, or 12 until they fix the issue with the sound, right? This ones don't have that problem. And the DJI don't have that problem because it has four mics on them. So every time you move the camera, the mic is gonna focus into that sound. So the quality of the sound of this camera is supposed to be a lot better than the GoPro Hero 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The only thing I don't like about this is that it doesn't have voice command, right? The GoPros have voice command, this doesn't have it. But this has the face recognition that it's gonna follow you and the GoPro doesn't have that. So there's things about each equipment that you're not gonna get everything, but what you get out of this, you get great sound, great video, awesome stabilization. Can't compare electric stabilization with a gimbal. This is really, really soft, the panning, professional. I love it. See right now I'm recording on it and look at the panning, how easy it moves around with no problems. All right guys, so this is gonna be my new camera for filming my videos and hopefully now I get better quality on the filming and better sound for you guys. All right guys, so this is the equipment that I've been using. Now I'm gonna start filming on this equipment and you guys will tell me if you notice a difference on quality. If you see this is a better quality, please let me know. And if you wanna check more information out about this equipment, I will place the link in the description below. All right guys, and hopefully now I get better quality of videos and sound for you guys. Thank you for watching and navigate safe.